right, whenever. Hey guys, welcome to Seagulls TV, proudly sponsored by Breast Suburban Taxis. Oh, not necessarily. I think that the first half was an arm wrestle, there's no doubt about that. Um, we let them kick, you know, we gave them, I think, two or three easy goals in the first, you know, ten minutes or so, and that, that obviously gave them a bit of a start, but, um, you know, the second quarter, we, we it was a real grinding game, I think, for, for, for the way both sides, I think, if you look at the stats so far this season, that both teams have been very good in putting the opposition under pressure, um, and I think that that's sort of what happened in the first half, the second half, we, we probably were able to just maintain that a bit better than probably what they could and and it was pleasing that all of a sudden we could we could start to uh, manufacture goals from our tools and our smalls in, in the forward line so it was you know sort of wasn't one area it was probably just us being able to stick a little bit harder in um, you know the physical aspect of the game yeah so uh, what was uh, I guess the big difference um, that, that turned it oh um, probably us being able to start winning the more the contested football. I think that once we sort of in the second half sort of got that, we were able to probably run a little bit harder on the outside or get numbers free on the outside um, and be able to do that. So as I said, the difference probably was we were I think we sort of stuck just a little bit longer being able to defend on, around the around the contested ball. Yeah, and uh, yeah, how, how are you feeling with? Uh, with with Klopp sitting out at the moment, obviously, and, and good to get Ben Jolly back as well. Yeah, oh yeah, look, that was some of the positives today, that um, Ben, been able to, um, you know, he's just, a, he's just our, our, you know, obviously our leader at the club, and he, um, you know, for the guy who's sort of been injured for a while, he didn't really miss a beat, he was he was fantastic for us. Um, you know, Jamie McNamara Mara come back as a, um, in, in played in our development side, so it's, it's pleasing to get him back, you know, so we still got, you know, Kowski and a few other places will come back, but you know, giving Dylan Conway his first opportunity this year, and um, you know, I thought he was you know worth probably four or five goals. He might have kicked them, but he you know he's just been able to create some goals for other players as well. But um, yeah, you know, some players I thought returned to a bit of good form in, in Nick Singh. Um, you know, been down the last couple of weeks. Uh, I thought Redpath was was fantastic down back. Him and uh, Austin were. Were terrific on you know they were undersized on their opponents on Gumbledon and Bell Chambers and Hill so for them to be able to you know hold hold down the you know the fort down back was was really pleasing so yeah look there was there was a lot of um, you know things that uh, that have sort of haven't been working for us so far but in the second half you know some players really stepped up yeah and it seems like uh, you've you've got the depth now to um, you know with some some of these players coming back to really make a big assault on the second half of the year. Yeah, look, Daniel Pierce, um, from the Western Bulldogs played in our development side and look, Daniel's a, you know, he's played AFL football so you know we've got a got some players there and we've got a, probably a few more um, doggies players who, who may come back as well but um, you know I think that uh, you know with our development side you know, we've got Damien uh, Bajia who's um, you know we just think is just an exciting player and, and uh, you know he's another player that we'll look to get in at some stage. And uh, no worries. Um, uh, you know, so you know we got some good young boys here. I thought you know Mackenzie was good. The, the Western Jet as our twenty third today. He was fantastic. So um, uh, you know, so there, yeah, there's still there's still a bit to like, and but I still know that we've still got you know, we've got a couple of really tough games coming up. Northern Blues and. And Box Hill, they're going to be um, two really tough games, and it probably almost could define our season in many ways. Uh, as you said before, you had a few tough tasks there coming up against Bell Chambers and Hill in the ruck. Was that a strong focus? Yeah, look, we probably felt that against Port Melbourne two weeks ago that we, you know, we were probably let down in that area a little bit. Um, so the challenge was really there for, um, you know, for Tommy Campbell and. Uh, Cam Wood and I thought, you know, uh, at times uh, early they, they looked at, you know, they, at times didn't go their way, but I thought that ultimately in the end they just really worked hard and we probably got over the top of them in that area. So, um, you know, so that, that's good for, for certainly those two guys and, um, you know, good, and that allowed us to win a lot of those stoppages, which, which
which was really important in terms of the outcome of the game.